So my test is complete and I in fact did not have the Wi-Fi setting on this phone and apparently I didn't have it on my previous phone either so I had given up on using the phone to record videos and for a while I just didn't do any videos at all and then I finally started doing them in my room right directly on my computer but you know that was very limited in the type of videos that I did and so um, I just uh, whatever um, brought brought it about I realized what was going on and so now this has given me a new lease on life I just got off my computer and ordered uh, a tripod on Amazon so I, I will be able to um, be in the video and for instance do some unboxing which I just did um, I had ordered a pair of Fenton shoes which uh, this was from the later era of Fenton glass now at least it said Fenton now unless you see the actual stamping of Fenton and they are not there's not really a lot of consistency um, some are stamped on the bottom some are not some have stickers um, and this one is very unusual to where I really didn't know if I should believe whether it was Fenton or not because uh, a lot of these have the cats but what this one has is it has like a lacing on the side as if the shoe could get laced up so I almost didn't know if I should believe that this was an actual Fenton but it was unique enough to add it to my very <laughs> growing collection this began with um, I think my grandmother passed away in maybe 1980 it was before I had any kids at all uh, so it was maybe 19 oh geez I don't know 85 let's say and I think it's this this red shoe right here that uh, was the one and only shoe that she had she had various knickknacks but um i ended up choosing that particular knickknack of hers and um i had it on a shelf of you know miscellaneous knickknacks for many years and didn't really think about it but then i was at an antique store one time and saw another shoe like it and you would think that i would know which was my second shoe that I bought. I think it might have been an amber color, but um, so then for a while I just had two. But then something got into me and um, um, I started collecting them. In fact, one of the things that did get into me about this is that when, um, when, when a couple of people had passed away, when it started rack, <laughs> racking up, um, where by now um, my late husband had passed away, my mother had passed away, and my father had passed away. So by the time my father had passed away, and um, we, you know, we had gone through their belongings. And I walked away with um, okay, what um, what I, I guess all three of them were minimalists. So um, when it was all said and done, uh, their clothing went to goodwill, and um, you know they're some some of the books that they had and you know a lot of their belongings went to goodwill and if there was a car you know it got sold and there really wasn't much left of them and um you know sometimes on facebook you hear people say oh stuff you know in a really bad way they say stuff and 
well, I, I've seen the other side of stuff. I've seen it where there's nothing left of a person after they pass away. There's just nothing. You know, it's just like they just vanish into oblivion. You know, there's maybe a photo album left, but that's it. You know, so um, at least with my grandmother, there was a couple of knickknacks. Okay, well, okay, all right, so maybe I'm going a little bit crazy. Okay, fair enough. But um, it, it was in, it, it was due to the last three minimalists who passed away where it's like you people had absolutely nothing, nothing, you know, other than, well, I'm not even saying, you know, um, so there was like a night shirt, a night shirt from my mother, but they, there, there's not that much of a, that almost just doesn't count. You know, um, eventually, even if I wear it a lot, that's going to uh, eventually wear out. Um, so this is really basically why I started doing this. I just thought, well, I just kind of want somebody to go through my house when I die and well, okay, maybe they won't like Benton glass shoes. I don't know, but um, you know, a few people can go through and choose a few and just have a few of these shoes to put on their shelf and say, okay, that's what they that's what they have from me. So that's, that's that. All right. Okay. Bye-bye.